So what's going on guys? It is Saturday, 20 past 12, and I just got back from work. I had a couple of clients and I had a workout afterwards. I'm absolutely drained of energy. I need carbs. So as you can see, I'm totally ravenous. Oh God, what a week. I've got to fill you in and I'm going to do a weekend vlog. We've got loads of things going on. Let's go. I just really want some designer pants. <laughs> we'll get you some designer pants, babe. So we are going to my auntie's for some afternoon tea and I'm not going to film there, but I will film afterwards because afterwards we're going down the Herm Bay. We're going to see Zoe and Chloe, isn't it? Yeah. Kim and Chloe, basically. Uh, my sister's playing down the seafront as well and we're basically just going down the seafront to see what the crack is. It should be nice and no doubt we'll be getting an a la Turca. We are caked out. Wowza. So now we're going down to the bay. I'm in she baked a lot, a lot of cake and it was lush. Music like this is life. like the coolest because I've got a scarf and a jumper but up. Are you managed to fit that in there? Yeah. Have you got my purse in there? Yeah. So I've we're off down to purse. the clock tower. Gosh she's got my purse. That's <laughs> funny. Um <laughs> see Zoe and Chloe and then Josh and Amanda are gonna come down as well. I need to grab a drink a bit. Probably see probably see you know who down there. For receipt of uh <laughs> Show the camera, babe. Where's Josh gone? Oh my god, I said. Hi, Josh. because we're all drunk because this is meant to be a fitness and health channel this is Zoe yeah go on get your bicep <laughs> go on tent tent oh yeah I don't have one you got all right what a fucking brilliant night Kim, Zoe, Josh and Amanda, my babe. Brilliant night, brilliant day. And this is why I'm so blessed and we're so blessed, aren't we? Yeah. Because we've got such fucking good friends around us. And like tomorrow we got, we're hosting a barbecue and we know that everyone there is a genuine support and a genuine friend. I'm gonna go to the gym and then we're having a barbecue tomorrow. So I'll catch up with you in the morning. Hopefully get you um, following my gym workout. I'm not sure how it's gonna be because I've had a, quite a bit to drink. Love you. What's going on guys? Half nine in the morning, hungover, leg session. This is gonna be tough. Start off with five sets of squats, uh, warm up set, with 15 reps on 30 kilograms.
So I've just got back from my leg session and it went moderately well. I did five exercises, five sets on each, and then 30 minutes of cardio at the end of it. Uh, squats were okay. I've been getting lower back, uh, sore lower back, so I took it a bit lighter. Just went up to 80, I can't even breathe, 80 kilograms um, for sets of 12. Uh, sweat, bleh, bleh, sets of 12, five sets of 12. Um, and yeah, finished off with an incline walk because obviously yesterday we had a lot of drink, a lot of cake and a lot of food. So I'm in quite um, a surplus at the minute. I've got a bit of a bloat in my belly from the alcohol. I get kind of like a churning bloat. So I'm going to have some uh, cottage cheese, which usually settles your gut. And um, yeah, just enjoy this. I must admit, I'm feeling so much better coming off the steroids. I can't believe how much they made me feel depressed. It's almost like... I was totally um, unaware of how they can have the negative effect on you as well as making you feel quite strong and quite positive. It totally had the reverse effect on me. Um, whether that's because I could feel quite strong anyway, but like mentally it, it buggered me up so much that when I would go, for example, in the gym or go to work, I couldn't, I didn't have the energy because in my head I was down. So... Yeah, when when your head's down, you have less energy. It was if you've got a positive mind, you're you're buzzing. You're a bit more like energetic. Um, so I've been off them since Tuesday now. So it's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, five days, and I actually feel you know clear of negativity, which is brilliant. So today we've got friends coming over for a barbecue. I'm gonna sort the garden out. I oh, just currently food shopping. I'll show you what she buys. I've let her loose in Asda. Um, so we're probably just gonna be eating a load of meat. Maybe a little bit more alcohol and just a good laugh, so. Right, so it's time to do some gardening, methinks. So backyard is set up, ish. Nah. We are smoking it all up. Oh, smoke me out. Lose, lose somewhere in there. Oh, she'll give you a smoky taste. We don't want to go out and then we'll be out and people will say fire. I've just got visions of the fire engine turning up. Oh my god, up. we haven't got a fire extinguisher. No, 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 we actually don't have any of this stuff. We'll just get the beer in the road. Very deadly. Yeah. That's not my name. No, but it is. That's too flimsy. I get broads in the land, just with the penis, see the drum. I'll cut the cards in the scan, we got a sex, so we stay the same. What would you let us in? They need to kill in the drum. You literally ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that um, everything? I think so. Have you got your house keys? Uh, yep. <sighs> 20 past 8. We went to bed about 2. Yeah. Quite a crazy barbecue. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to go up to the lake to detox, basically. No gym. No clothes. Well, actually, we've got clothes. And, uh, yeah, literally just going up there, whatever. It was a real good night. Though. It was a really good night with the crew. God knows where they went to and what they got up to afterwards. <laughs> Well, I think only a few of them went out, didn't they? Only a couple went out. Sam, Ryan, and Jem. Three. Three. Could not have done that. We got quite messy. So, yeah. It was quite um, late. Yeah. Man in the Shell garage on the way to. I don't even know where we're going to. Reading. Thanks for our sweets. <laughs> I can't believe, I don't understand. So I literally, just, no, he was like, oh, what number are you? 
And I was like, two, 20. And it was like 20 on 20, yeah? And it was like, you like the rock? And I was like, yeah, I like the rock. And it was like, here's some rock cake. <laughs> I think it's going to taste nice. I actually think that's going to taste it. well nice. I'll try a bit of you. Yeah. So this video is going to be like about just these three days, basically this weekend, and it's been mega good, hasn't it? Yeah. It, it was, we went out on the... Spontaneous Sally. We've been really fucking spontaneous McSally sons. But I just wanted to like show like how different I am off steroids. It's literally made such a difference. I'm so much more relaxed, like, just coming off them, which is brilliant. I'm so much more relaxed, I'm so much happier. Um, I just, I can't believe how much of an effect they had on me. Like, obviously I'm still a bit worried, I'm still, I've still got cancer. It's not it lifted the fact that I've got cancer, but it has helped. Am I different? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now we're off to Reading to just to chill for the day and see Ash's parents. Um, I'm literally taking a t total day off activity. No cardio, no gym at all. And then I'm gonna smash it Tuesday to Friday and then the Saturday I'm off to an auto jumble so I'll have another rest day. So it might be quite good for me to have a couple of rest days in this proximity. Especially when your mouth is so, um, like, I feel like it's very sensitive. Like we need to be careful. You yeah. need to make sure that you're keeping it. I know it sounds silly, but all the vitamins, minerals, like make sure you're eating everything so that yeah. it gives your mouth the best chance it's got of staying calm. Yeah, and I've got some pains in my feet and hands. Like, quite bad. Yeah, like I've got a really big pain right there in my hand. I don't know what it, I don't know whether I've done something to it. Anyway, I'll catch up with you when we're in Reading. I don't know how much footage I'll get today. We're probably just going to be mooching, but I'll, I will get footage and show you where, what it's like up the, in the lake, on the lake, in the lake, on the lake. All right, I'll see you in a bit, guys. <sighs> we made it to Reading, hanging at our asses. Well, ours is not hanging, she's sensible. And we've discovered a lake. Nice, <laughs> You going in the boat? Yeah. yeah. She doesn't want me to. You take. Okay. The boat will pull you. Yeah. And then you start. Standing up slowly. Okay, and then we'll say hit it and we'll go really slowly. You Are you a proud mum? Like yeah, definitely proud mum. And go steep. And then you just keep your arms straight and you stand up and lean back at the same time. And then once you're leaning back, your skis are staying together. Okay, go on then. Just the right a little bit. Go on. Go on. Come on, come on, more, 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 more. Yeah! This girl is a pro at water skiing. I didn't realise you were so that good. Oh. You are, you're fucking brilliant. So we went out, I didn't get up on mine. You did, you got up. It felt, probably felt like you didn't, but you did. 100% you got up. Did I? Mm -hmm. uh, and Aisha killed it. We're just relaxing now, and I think we're gonna go out for a dog walk in a bit, so. It's literally like zen down here, isn't it? Off home. Yeah. So we've got about a two hour drive home. But it's been a fucking brilliant weekend. This is going to be the best recovery video I've ever put up. Yeah. But the recovery. 
and a half. So yeah, I'm gonna end this vlog right here. Um, thanks to everyone who was involved with this weekend as well. Like who came over and whatnot, my auntie and whatever. You know who you are. So what's next one? Treatment's not yet. What I'll do is I'll do a video that's like training, fitness, all that malarkey. Food. <coughs> Food. And then... But then we're hitting it hard with the hospital. It's gonna be yeah. Awesome. Like, we've got a break. We've got two weeks. Then we've got 16th. We're hitting it hard. We've got treatment, 16th. Saturday we've got CT scan. Tuesday, MRI. Thursday, results. And then what else? Four times, four different days. Four out of the six days we'll be on in hospital. God, yeah, it's four gonna be hell on earth. FML. Sometimes it'll be it done. works out the scans are all on the same day, and other times it doesn't. But at least you're only having the CT and the MRI. So that is it, guys. Thanks for watching. We are. I want to go in there. Shattered. I'm going to drive home. I'll see you in the next video. Say bye, babe. Bye. Bye.